we have got a female rhino and a young, or not young, but a baby rhino. And uh, they are together with a nice big bull, a nice male rhino. It's just quite close by to them. So this over here is the white rhino or the wide mouth rhino. So you notice, you see the lip, the lip goes like that. It's a very wide lip. As with the black rhino or the hook-lipped rhino, it's got a hook lip like that. Because these guys are uh, grass eaters, so they're grazers, and then uh, your black rhino is a browser. So, if you are looking for the perfect lawnmower in your in your garden, get yourself a white rhino because they cut the grass perfectly like that. They irrigate it and they fertilize it because they defecate about every three to four hours. So they get constant compost, perfect lawnmower. Rhinos, funny enough, only physically sleep for 30 minutes of the entire day. They rest for about three, four hours, um, but they only sleep an actual like pass out sleep for 30 minutes the entire day. I would say probably a good five, six times a week we'll bump into some rhinos, especially white rhinos. Black rhinos, yeah, that's the tricky one. They're very territorial and very solitary composed to white rhinos which you, they are um, they are te males technically are territorial but they share territory with other males so you see them they're, they're much more social so that's why what we've got behind us here is a nice group of them it's the black rhino that belongs to the big five however saying that because of rhinos numbers diminishing over the years a rhino is part of the big five now but technically speaking it's the black rhino.